it's Iris Sea Dollies here and welcome or welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be filming the AG Tube Halloween tag created by Sophie AG. The first question is, what is your favourite Halloween candy? We don't really have that many Halloween specific sweets in Ireland, but I would say one of my favourite things to be when you go, one of my favourite things when you go trick or treating is if someone was to give me a Terry's chocolate orange which is pretty rare, or something like Doritos. Number two, what is your favorite doll Halloween costume from AG? Okay, you know what? The first thing that actually came to mind was the Bumblebee one, which I'll put on screen. I also love that one, which is one, I forget what it's called. It has like the black dress with the purple shirt. And also the Pleasant Company ones were really, really cool. There's like a hippie one, which is really swag and a mermaid one. Literally go look at all the Pleasant Company Halloween costumes because they're so cool, but probably one of those ones. Number three, what are you being for Halloween this year? Okay, this one is pretty basic. I usually have better costumes than this, but I kind of forgot about Halloween this year. So I'm being a cat. I know, very basic. I've just got a black dress. I'm gonna wear black tights, black shoes, black blazer or something. And I got my little cat ears yesterday, so we have to hope my dress comes on time. That's what I'm being for Halloween. Number four. If your dolls were a type of candy, which one would they be or taste like? Hmm, this is really hard, okay. Um, Winnie is really like sweet, so I would say you know the little like sweetheart things? I'll, <laughs> I'm just gonna put those pictures on the screen because I don't even know if you guys have the same sweets in the US, but probably those sweetheart things. Nenea, ooh, what would Nenea be? I feel like Nenea would be a chocolate color covered strawberry. I know that's not specifically candy, but chocolate covered strawberry or chocolate covered pineapple. I don't even know why, just that's what came to mind. Caroline would definitely be salt and vinegar Pringles because that's what I would be and she's the most similar to me. Um, this is a really hard question. I feel like Leah wouldn't be a candy, she just seems like a very much granola bar type of gal but if I was to give her one... Oh actually I changed my answers on someone. Okay. I would make Leah tangy cheese Doritos. This is very, this is a very serious question, clearly. Caroline would be, um, what you call it? Caroline would be a marvelous creation bar. Alia would be, oh my God, I'm running out of things. We'll just, we'll make Alia, oh, fizzy, fizzy worms. The fizzy worms, I love them. And Gracie would be, <laughs> Oh, a croissant. A <laughs> croissant. Um, a macaron or a macaroon. Either. I like both. They both work. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Number five. If you could be any historical doll for Halloween, which one would you be and why? I'm gonna say Marie Grace. Because she has the coolest outfits. Apart from Caroline, but. I'm gonna go with Marie Grace because Caroline was like, I don't really know Marie Grace's story, but Caroline was war times and I feel like there's something to do with a masquerade ball with Marie Grace, so I would be Marie Grace. <laughs> Question number six. What is the longest amount of time you've gone trick or treating? Probably like four hours or something, I don't know. I love trick or treating. Probably from like 6 p.m. No, not 6, 7 p.m. till 10? Maybe six. I, I don't even know. Six-ish till ten-ish, I would say, would be the latest. You don't really knock on anyone's doors later than that. Ten is probably pretty late. So, something like that. I love trick-or-treating. I'm, like, kind of too old for it now. But I wish I wasn't. In my first year of... Um, it's, like, the equivalent to the last year of middle school. It was my first year of high school. I just <laughs> I wanted to go trick-or-treating. And the second year. We did go trick-or-treating the first year. The second year, um, we didn't, and I was really sad about it. I was like, please can we go trick-or-treating? And we did not, so, yeah. Before I finish up, I just wanted to say 
we're almost at 400 subscribers. We're 11 subscribers away, which it blows my mind. I'm really excited to do the New Year's tag this year because the amount of difference is mad and I'm very excited. It's It's been a wild year and I'm very sorry for not uploading for the last two weekends. That is all. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you have a very happy Halloween and I will see you all in the next video. Bye.